Hello everyone and welcome to Onik News. In today's topic we talk about Kim Ho Jong's agency Think Entertainment responding to latest allegations of illegal stock acquisition. This channel provides you with the latest K-pop and Korean related news every day, so make sure to hit the subscribe button for the latest news and trends. Today's video is sponsored by the new wave DGOD Din Hasty Clothing. Grab their free shirts giveaway by following them on Instagram at Din Hasty Clothing and comment which shirt you like from their website www.dinhastyclothing.com. So let's get it started. Kim Ho Jong's agency, Think Entertainment, has responded to allegations of illegal stock acquisition. Comedian Kim Han Bae and former co-CEO of Think Entertainment, Yung Yin Ho, have filed a lawsuit, claiming that they will hold those responsible accountable. On the matter, Think Entertainment stated we have confirmed that Kim Han Bae and another individual filed a lawsuit against the company on May 29 for alleged improper transfer of ownership. They further added we plan to take legal action against Kim Han Bae and others for false claims and filing lawsuits related to criminal fraud and violation of the Act on Promotion of Information and Communications Network Utilization and Information Protection, etc. We will also seek compensation for damages resulting from illegal actions. The agency pointed out, Kim Han Bae and others have claimed in their lawsuit that they were shareholders of the company, but they have not provided any concrete evidence to support their claim that their shares were illegally transferred to someone else. They have not even accurately identified the individual who allegedly acquired their shares. Their lawsuit, based solely on speculation and without presenting evidence, constitutes an unlawful form of litigation prohibited by the Civil Procedure Act and raises suspicions of litigation fraud. Earlier, online media outlets reported that Kim Han Bae and Yung Mian Ho had filed a complaint against Think Entertainment's CEO Lee Kwang Jok and three executives on suspicion of fraud and forgery of documents under the Specific Economic Crimes Act, forgery of official documents, and complicity in fraud. What do you think about it? Please let us know in the comments. This video was sponsored by DGOD Din Hasty Clothing. Don't forget to grab your free shirt by following them on Instagram at Din Hasty Clothing and comment which shirt you like from their website www.dinhastyclothing.com. Subscribe to our channel and get the latest K-pop and Korean related news every day. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.